Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix a frozen KDE window manager. So to start off, we need to open up the link in the description, get to this guide that I wrote, scroll down, and we can see this is how you can deal with your window manager. So if you're having an unresponsive window manager, you can just open up a terminal and you can type in kill all kwin. Now, I run this on my Arch Linux distribution. And now sometimes you may need to do kwin x11, like so. Now, that will kill the window manager. So you run kwin or kwin x11. And uh, to start it, you can do kwin dactac replace. And uh, if you're using Ubuntu, or at most other distributions, you'll be able to run kwin replace, and then for Arch Linux, like I said, x11. Now that will recreate our window manager, and we have a working window manager again. So if you've ever dealt with, you know, a KDE Plasma window manager that just hasn't been working right for you, you can just go ahead and restart it. Now, now in this guide, I also go over how you can make a kwin restart script, and what that will do is it'll automate restarting and replacing it. Now I'm not going to go over that in this guide uh, video because it's kind of complicated and it's hard to explain how scripts work in a video but do check that out but this is just a quick guide on how you can restart your window manager on the KDE Plasma desktop. So let's go over one more time. So if you're using Ubuntu you can just do kill all kwin or Fedora or anything like that and that will kill it. And if not, if you're using Arch Linux you can do kill all kwin x11. That will kill your window manager. You can then do kwin or kwin x11 in my case and then just do tac tac replace. And this will recreate our window manager and we will be able to use it just fine and that's great in case of a crash or an issue. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>